how to study the Allow Bible. Allow the Holy Spirit who inspired the word of God to reveal it to you. Read and think about each word in each scripture. You can check meanings too by using a concordance to study the Greek or Hebrew root word and their meanings. An important part of your study of the word is meditating. To meditate means to think deeply and continuously, ponder or reflect. It also means to murmur, to mutter, and to converse with oneself. This takes some time. Read the scriptures over and over again as you pray in the spirit. Meditation brings your spirit and your mind together and builds a capacity for your faith to be released. Romans 10 verse 17. Ask the Holy Spirit to open the eyes of your understanding so you can comprehend the deep things of God. Then expect the Lord to do it. Expect him to meet you on the level of your need and reveal his word to you. When starting out, spend the majority of your time in the New Testament, primarily in the letters the Apostle Paul wrote to early churches. In light of this, we suggest you to look for the underlying phrases such as in him, in whom and in Christ. These phrases are founded 134 times in the New Testament from Acts of, to Revelations. Every one of them has something to offer you personally because according to Ephesians 2 verse 6, you are in Christ. Yay. Make what God says the authority in your life. That means we shouldn't just believe what God says to us in his word, but we should also act on it. Acting on it is what produces results. Matthew 7, 24 to 27. Part of acting on the word includes speaking it. You will find that what you really believe in your heart is what you speak all the time. And what you speak determines what happens in your life. Mark 11 verse 23. Once you start speaking God's word about your needs, do not speak anything contrary to it. For example, if you need healing, do not let the focus of your word be about your sickness. Rather, confess what the word says about it. By his stripes, I'm healed according to Isaiah 53, 4 to 5. Like a sponge, soak in as much word as you poss as possible. Then when you are faced with a situation that requires the wisdom of God, the life of God will flow from you through your words to meet any man's needs on any level. And that's the best way to study the word with the intent of helping and loving others as well as yourself. To help in your study, we recommend the following. Young Analytical Concordance, a great help in finding verses that pertain to specific situations or needs it contains the hebrew and greek word translations you got to think of the word of god like your promised land you got to live the word of god you got to read your word and meditate it on on a day and night joshua one uh one and eight got to got to it's your manual for life it has all your answers and it brings you closer to the lord and that's how the lord speaks mostly through his word so make sure that you are reading your word day and night and meditating on it. Amen. Amen.